Hey guys, this is Booligan with Airsoft Retreat, BooliganAirsoft.com and Airsoft Insider Magazine. Today we're going to take a quick video look at the brand new Echo One Igor, which is part of their Red Star line. This is a full metal AEG with a metal receiver, metal um, dust cover here, and a metal MOX presser on the front. There are a few polymer parts throughout the gun. The thumbhole stock is polymer as well as the handguard. This gun will be available both with a black um, stock unit as well as a fake wood unit. The prices will be slightly different between the two. Currently it's listed at $220 for the black version, $230 for the fake wood version. Performance wise, this gun, the one that I am currently holding on to right now, which is a pre-production sample, it's one that's kind of gone around to a few different reviewers. Um, it's currently shooting right around 360 FPS with a .20 gram BB when shot through a Madwell chronograph. Rate of fire will vary depending on the battery used. It includes a stick type battery. I currently have a small stick LiPo battery, which is fitted in the stock. You unscrew two screws and it slides right in. You have plenty of room for battery. Semi-auto trigger response is quite good. On full auto, again, really not bad at all for a stock gun. Internally, the gun is fitted with a slightly modified version 3 gearbox fitted with 7mm steel bearings, steel gears, and a short length medium torque motor. You have a 428mm inner barrel that is fitted with a polycarbonate one piece clear hop up unit and an orange mad bolt bucking. Um, overall, the thing is very well built. There are obviously a few stylistic features that some players are not terribly happy with. That being said, the fake wood version comes out and adds to the look a lot. Um, but otherwise, I really like how the thing looks. It's a replica of a gun that basically hasn't been seen very much in the airsoft market. For aiming, you have a, uh, a rear sight that's adjustable for elevation and a front sight that's also adjustable for elevation, and it looks like it's adjustable for windage as well if you have a proper tool. Um, there is a mount on the side for mounting uh, PSO type optics. Basically your standard AK or SVD style uh, scope mount will work very well here. The gun includes two proprietary high cap magazines, each one holding 150 rounds. And of course it comes with Echo One's warranty, which they actually honor, as well as Echo One's lifetime of support in case something goes wrong with your gun down the line, even when it is out of warranty. Again, this thing will cost between 220 and 230 bucks, according to information on Echo One's website, and should be available very, very soon. Um, so be sure to check my website, Airsoft Retreat, as well as BooliganAirsoft.com for a complete written review of this gun, including detailed photos and information on it. Um, and of course, as always, thanks for watching.